What's good Fizz fam? What's Welcome good? back to Family Fizz. Today we are here at this absolutely gigantic Ikea behind us because we're going to be moving into our new house in a little over a week. So we're going to be shopping but not only that, we're going to be living off only Ikea foods for 24 hours. Come on guys, I'm really hungry. We haven't had breakfast yet. Yeah. So Fizz fam, Ikea does a really, really good breakfast from my parents. We've actually come just in time for their breakfast menu. I actually haven't had a cooked breakfast in a long time, so I'm really, really excited to see what they've got. We've got a little cake trolley. I feel like these are the famous IKEA restaurant trolley. Little juice? Yeah. Right, this looks absolutely incredible, but I'm not really thinking that's breakfast food, are you? <laughs> yeah. Maybe that could be for me or two which we have here. A lot of good looking drinks. What are you thinking, Georgie? I'm thinking of the wine, actually. What? The wine. <laughs> the wine? Yeah, it's only joking. <laughs> It'd be quite worrying if I was having wine. Oh, that sounds nice though. Peach and green tea. That looks nice, doesn't it? Yeah. What do you want, darling? I'll just copy you. Hi, can I have three of the regular vegetarian breakfast, please? We've just spotted a tropical fruit salad to fit which I think is perfect for a nice breakfast. Would you yeah. like one, Sienna? Yeah, you want one, Daddy? Please? Yes, please. You look like you're an old biddy. The best in the front. Coffee. Want a tea? Yes, please. I've got to say, wow, it is insanely cheap in here. I kept looking at everything, and there was like meals for 99p and stuff like that. So I feel it kind of rivals McDonald's in terms of super cheap, doesn't it? Right, like Darren's currently salivating behind the camera because he's got to go and camera duty, don't you? Well, we taste test the. Vegetarian IKEA cooked breakfast, which consists of hash browns, vegetarian sausages, baked beans, and mushrooms. And we made this vegan by not having an omelette, didn't we? And yes. so we got an extra hash brown as a result, which I actually think is my favorite part. Mm. Really oniony mm. and a nice crisp to it, crisp texture, and it's really moist. These are really, really good. I love hash browns. I love like some kind of potato element to cook breakfast. Let's try the actual main component though, the sausage. Actually, this is a really good one. It looks like it's mashed potato, some kind of pearl barley grain, and then carrots. Well, in terms of the whole meal overall, I think I'm gonna give it a eight out of 10. Really? Maybe nine out of 10. Wow, really? I really like it, yeah. I know it's lacking though, and I'm disappointed. I was looking around for it. There, there isn't any tomato ketchup or barbecue, like sachets or pots or bottles anywhere. I'm disappointed about that. One satisfied IKEA customer, my empty plate of breakfast there. I'm now gonna go and give you a little taste check of this Firefly peach and green tea drink. It's like a botanical drink, it's got cola nut in it, yerba mate. Am I pronouncing that right? Yerba mate. Yerba mate and rosemary and green tea. Oh, that's delicious. Guys, I was right, this is good. And I'm a bit concerned about all of the stimulants in this and me being in Ikea. Right, so I've got a little challenge. As we're in Ikea, and like I said, it's a Swedish shop, we have to all day try and pronounce all of the Swedish words. So do you want to go first? Smicka. How would you say current list? The pronunciation king. Smika. 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 Guys, so I found this. It's the IKEA jungle quest. You have to like find all the animals, and then there's like a map where you have to find them. And then it says once you've found all of them, go to IKEA bistro or Swedish food market to collect your prize. She wasn't joking when she said about the green tea. Hey, get out of this bag. Get out. Kama, not, I know we always say this, but he said, no, it was Karma last night. She was like, Mom, 2 a.m. She's going, Mom, my hairbrush, get my hairbrush. I don't know why. So I'm really tired. Oh, oh. I'm gonna get us kicked out. Oh, this is so comfy. Let's go, Sienna, quick. <laughs> Let's do a sleeping challenge. Who can fall asleep in Ikea the first? Okay, bye. Bye. <laughs> I need to show inside my pantry. And this is like a dream country for me. Look how organized it is. I'm in love, look at it. And then you've even got the little curry hooks to put your reusable bags and things. What I'm doing for this time is taking those photos and saving them in a little folder on my phone of all the things that I want for the house. Dungeon skull. <laughs> also known as a soft well, toy tiger. I found a tiger, the tiger. So that's the first animal, so okay. I'd better write that down. Oh, look, Lucy, you know, we're never too old for a cuddly toy. Come 
scary. It's scary? Yeah, it's terrifying. This guy looks like it's been living off the IKEA food. Let's just make you broody, Dara. Enough baby. Really about that. <laughs> this just makes me Can think you hear a wheel spin noise this time? <laughs> <laughs> You know the milk crate stacking challenge, this one. We're gonna do it with these like baby steps instead. We've actually got five hundred thousand baby steps, so. Uh, there's also more here as well. Right, so you gonna do it? No. Okay. How satisfied are you with this experience? Well, it's obviously the food areas, isn't it? Yeah. Brilliant. We went to the. What? There's more. Restaurant, bistro, cafe, Swedish food market. What? what? I'm hungry. I thought there was just a cafe. I'm already hungry. Guys. Where were we? The cafe? Yeah. yeah. No, or was it the what restaurant? The restaurant? No. No. I don't know. We're extremely satisfied. So the next animal is an orangutan, but I think we haven't really done it in order because we're in the children's area. IKEA, children's IKEA, so. Dukti, Nibakad, Flisat. Darn, darn, that one. Circus style. Jungle skog. Jungle skog. She can't get out. It's now lunch time, so we're gonna go back to the restaurant cafe thing. I don't really know what it's called. I'm going to get some lunch. <laughs> I promise we could have cake. This one looks incredible. The vegan raspberry chocolate cake. Oh, they go down in this. So I have heard that IKEA is famous for its meatballs. And I'm sorry if you watch this video, we know how much you love balls, but you missed out on this one today, Mia. Oh, there's loads of stuff there. Have you looked in the board? I saw soup sienna, penne pasta with Mediterranean sauce, and then there's um, some palm balls. Oh, I think we should go for the palm balls, yeah. we? We've got to get the IKEA meatballs if we're coming to IKEA. Check out this IKEA lunch. This is the Swedish meatballs and this is the 12 plant balls. So I need to check first of all that there is actually 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. How do they know? How do they know? No, they just it? scoop it on like so. They just did it so casually. Should we both try ball at the same yeah. time? Ready? Mm. They're quite meaty in texture. Mm -hmm. So the sausage we had this morning was kind of herby, planty. This does taste like a meatball. So they've tried to make like a vegan version of a meatball, which they're tasty, aren't they? Mm, yeah. Chips with cranberry sauce is a little bit interesting, but it's actually quite nice. Mm, good, it's a good lunch. So you got raspberry, I got yeah. blackcurrant, and you got apple, didn't you, Darren? Should we all try it at the same time? Cheers. Cheers, Cheers Fizz fam. Cheers, Ikea. Mm. Very delicious. Tastes like Ribena Cheers. if it was fizzy. Tastes like appetizer. Chocolate and raspberry vegan cake. That's actually quite moist. Mm. Mm. It's really good. Look at this. It's decent. I would give this cake a 10 out of 10. I'd give it a 9. Mm. I think it's really decent. It's really rich, isn't it? Mm. So if you want a nice, like, sickly chocolate cake, this is it. <laughs> We've got to get our energy up for some actual serious furniture shopping. At least we haven't got kicked out yet. I love the word yet yeah, is on the end of the sentence. Okay, this is the fifth animal and it's the bear. And it's actually the little teddy, little, um, little. <laughs> fish. The big bear that um. No yeah. yeah. This looks good, doesn't it? Yeah, because I, I really want to get like some kind of mat. Yeah. And like. Yeah, this is perfect. Like, I would like a desk like this with a little storage. The same is really important. Pink bar. We showed her. Um, we actually showed that in a video, didn't we? Yeah. Surprisingly, with it. But in your bedroom, you do want to have a desk for a sewing yeah. machine and also for a little area to write on and do yeah. kind of schooling, yeah. don't you? So yeah, this good. Is, yeah, this looks amazing. Yeah. All the space. Oh, oh. another one there. Hi, Fizz fam. We're actually going to give you a sneak preview of a house tour of our new house, okay? We're going to come inside. So here we have a nice open pan living room. And here we have the kitchen, which we know, all know I've said about 100 times. Actually, no, it's about 6,342 times because how many times we've moved house. This is Georgie's, Mummy Fizz's favourite place. Yeah, and then here we have. Mum and Dad's bedroom. Right here. Mum 
Dad's bedroom. <laughs> and then we have the bathroom. Now, say, hold it in, hold it in. Oh, hold it in. Hi. Here we have my bedroom. Don't know where me and the baby sleep. Here we have Daddy Lucas' chair. Oh, oh, wow. Really comfortable. Is it? Maybe you can put an iPad yeah. here. Oh, that looks good. Alright, bye. Yay. See you. Built for both ups and downs. <laughs> I like what you did there, Ikea. Wow, I really love this kitchen oh setup. I love the curves. Like in our house, I know a lot of some of the like the parts of the house, like the kitchen and that, we can't really change because it's already been fitted. But where we can buy furniture with rounded edges or curves, I really want. It's really good for feng shui and it looks stylish. But look, I feel they're kind of saying that you can turn this into a coffee shop. They're giving people inspiration. But Darren, it would be our matcha shop, wouldn't it? Your business yeah. way, but matcha first. Like this is, like, here's fine. We should set for a matcha shop. And you think so? Where's the pestle? Eat it, go on. No. You found it. It's a shark, and this is the last one on the press. You get to get your prize, don't you? Yeah, yeah. Um, I go to Ikea Bistro, a Swedish food market, to collect my prize. That's actually where we want to go. Yeah. For dinner, yeah. let's go. Yeah, because we've already been to the other place live. So, Ikea Swedish food market and Ikea Bistro this way. I Bye. see the bistro. Oh, and there's a chickless strip meal, three pound based strips, fries, and a drink. Hi. Can I have the chickless strip meal, please? One of those. And then can I also have the veggie dog meal, please? Do you have the strawberry soft serve? Um, oh, what the, what, the machine's not working. Oh, uh, yeah, the vegan machine isn't working. Oh, okay then. Right, thank you. Yeah, we'll just get those two, please. Thank you. I'm so gutted for this fam. I was really, really excited to try the soft serve. The and soft serve machine is broken. And I'm getting really, really hot now. I can tell so it's really bad. It's like, like I really badly wanted to try that. But at least we do have some savory. But we do have some more food options that we can get from the marketplace. I'm excited. So I'm sure we're going to find some from Sweet Sienna. But yeah. I'm... Oh, thank you. Ah, oh, thank you. The hot dog is now on its way down. I don't know what you want. I actually quite fancy this. Do you want a hot dog now? Okay, yeah, well, thank we you. Try. We can all share, there you go, Sina. You said there wasn't any ketchup earlier, and now look at this. Wow, this is amazing. What do I do, pump it? Yeah, go on. What? <laughs> what did you do to that machine? Right, bye guys, bye. Look. <laughs> look what's here. <laughs> wow, it's light. Yay, that's it. really hard doing it behind the camera. Review the IKEA hot dog. That's pretty decent. Yeah? yeah? Let's have a look at it close up. That's a lot of sauce. Oh, you look like that TikTok where it's just it's covered in sauce. Mm. So we're now at the food market and I'm fancying something sweet because the machine, IKEA tap tap, wasn't working. So I had me a bit hiccup, so I, I really swallowed the chipless strip fast, like I swallowed it too fast, you know when it's like stuck in your throat. So let's have a little look, it'll be fancy. I know that IKEA is famous for all of its like Swedish style biscuits. Kaffir crepe, ginger thins, organic. They're organic as well, that's good, isn't it? Well, ginger thins with almonds. These are good, aren't they? Wow, that is huge. Look at that cactus. Wow, that was last wow. year like, Christmas. I really want to try these Swedish sweets and they're like Viking ship ones and they're also sour. I love sour sweets and they're like cola. How food. do you say they're it, Sina? Try and say it. If you don't pronounce it properly, you're not having them. <laughs> <laughs> Look what I found, Sina. I don't know. I've got some Lord of Dusk Otters. <laughs> can I do a bit of Hang on, what are they? Lord Dad What? <laughs> I don't know. I'm saying it really fast and you don't know how to send it around. Lord Dad a sun foam candy with pear and forest fruit flavour. I've got those oh for Mia because oh. I know she'll love them. And for Karen Karma to share, oh. I've got them these foam candy with strawberry or vanilla flavour ice cream. No, that's not what they're called. What are they called? Lord Dad called this. It's a sweet enough for us. I think it definitely yes. is. Yes. Simply for us to ask what your price is. Yeah, because I'm happy. Go and ask you for your prices. Alright, you have to pay. Karen. <laughs> vegetable ball. Pepper. <laughs> we literally had that for lunch. Maybe it's like from a particular date or something. Yeah. What? I doubt it's the ones that we ate. Hi. First of all, she's um. Ellie. Ellie. Oh, so apple Ooh, they look good. Yeah, they've got loads of sweets 
Don't mind us guys, back in Ikea. So I'm gonna go and try one of the, oh, I'm gonna let you do it. One of the Viking chips. What? I Viking. swear, no, I swear. Lord Ag's gorgeous. Sour Jelly Candy Curler. Oh, really nice, really good. What have we got some They were your freebie prize, weren't they? Sour oh, yeah. foam candy with apple flavor. Well, this is really, really nice to have something sweet after all that food. Mm. I know everybody had cake today, but you know. Should we just change some 24 hours into Ikea you know, then, or what? Well, like trying to stay in here overnight without getting caught. Yeah. That would be fun. We've got babies to get back to. Oh. We should do that one day, though. For mm. definite. Comment down below. Do you think we should stay overnight in Ikea? Now I'm going to go and deliver these sweets to Kawakama and Mia. See you next Let video. Let me go. Bye. Bye. We're officially Swedish people.